Your air conditioning system is made up of three basic components. A compressor, located in the unit outside your home, the condenser coil, also in the outdoor unit, and the indoor evaporator coil, usually installed near your furnace or inside your air handler. Air conditioners use a gas called a refrigerant that transfers heat to the outside condenser coil through a chemical reaction when the refrigerant is compressed by the compressor. This chemical reaction takes place in a contained area within your air conditioner, and it pulls the heat out of the refrigerant. Once the warm refrigerant is cooled, it is sent into your home's indoor evaporator coil. The blower pulls warm air from throughout your house and moves it over the evaporator coils, which cool it and circulate it through your home. Some air conditioning systems can also be used to heat your home. These are referred to as heat pumps. The process we just discussed is simply reversed, and the same three basic components are used. A compressor, located in the unit outside your home, the condenser coil, also in the outdoor unit, which will now act like the evaporator coil when heating your home, and the indoor evaporator coil, usually installed near your furnace or inside your air handler, which will now act as the condenser coil when your home is being heated. Heat pumps use a gas called a refrigerant that transfers cool air to the outside condenser coil through a chemical reaction when the refrigerant is compressed by the compressor. This chemical reaction takes place in a contained area within your heat pump and it pulls the cold out of the refrigerant. Once the cool refrigerant is warmed, it is sent into your home's indoor evaporator coil. The blower pulls cool air from throughout your house and moves it over the evaporator coils, which warm it and circulate it through your home.